As internet challenges continue to hamper students and teachers in online classes, Science and Technology Minister Daryl Vaz says a holistic plan for internet service is well on its way. Today, Minister Vaz gave an update on the internet hotspots and school internet service improvement initiatives. As part of the government's response to internet challenges, a plan for internet hotspots in each constituency under the Universal Service Fund was announced several months ago. In Parliament on Tuesday, Science and Technology Minister Daryl Vaz responded to Opposition Leader and Member of Parliament for South St. Andrew, Mark Golding, who has criticised the pace of the implementation. It has not even started yet in this constituency and it's really disheartening that these things are being so delayed. All 189 communities have been selected based on recommendations of MPs. Based on a discussion I had and a meeting I'm to have on Thursday, I'm seeking to change from four phases to three phases and to have everything completed for the 189 Wi-Fi hotspots by the end of this financial year, which means March 2022. Low quality or no internet at public schools affects over 600,000 students. Mr. Vaz reiterated the three-tier grouping of schools for a private government data network for each group. Tier 1 covers over 660 schools with 100 to 400 students requiring 10 to 40 megabits per second of bandwidth. Tier 2 covers rural schools that have up to 400 students but lack internet infrastructure. Implementation is expected by the end of the current school term. Tier 3 addresses schools with 500 to 2,000 students, requiring up to 400 megabits per second. Installation is to be completed by November. Additionally, Madam Speaker, it will allow the government the ability to monitor the performance of each school internet service in real time. Most importantly, the government will have the ability to centrally filter content to make sure that students are not exposed to illicit and inappropriate material. He says once the outstanding procurement procedures are completed, schools and the surrounding communities will experience better internet service.